Mr. Chris Little has sought leave to present a public petition, and in accordance with Standing Order 22, the member will have up to three minutes to speak. I call Mr. Chris Little. <coughs> Thank you, Mr. Speaker. It's a privilege for me to have the opportunity to present this petition of over 6,000 signatures to the Education Minister on behalf of the Parents for Equal Education Coalition, calling for the full-time nursery provision for children with special educational needs in our community to be maintained. Mr. Speaker, it's children like Charlie and parents like Angela and the many others that have gathered here at Parliament buildings today have been an inspiration to me and to many other MLAs. The dignity and the commitment that they are showing in their fight for full-time special educational needs nursery provision for their children is in stark contrast to the totally unacceptable approach of the Education Authority, who has failed to disclose parental and principal opposition to their proposals to this Assembly and has failed to engage with parents meaningfully on this issue. I would call on the Education Minister to avoid becoming associated with this flawed approach and to make clear his support for full-time special educational needs nursery provision in our community. Mr. Speaker, I thank you for accepting this petition on behalf of the over 300 children who are only three years old and face having their futures made more uncertain. And I hope that the Minister of Education will indeed receive this petition. As I say, over 6,000 members of the public agree that we should be giving our children with special educational needs the very best start in life, and we should be maintaining these vital early education services. I know the Education Minister is monitoring this extremely serious issue, and I would call on all MLAs uh, to wake up to the urgency of this issue uh, and indeed work together to ensure that these reductions do not happen. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. If you bring forward the petition, the petition will then be lodged with the Minister of Education and a copy also sent to the uh, committee. <laughs>